Hi everybody, so I want to give you this option to place out of Math 60 and join Math 70 in week two. Math 70 is the next pre-college math class. Um, so you don't have to take this option, but if you'd like to, here's how to do it. Um, so basically um, every term, a few students in Math 60 say, hey, I didn't need the whole class. Um, I could have just reviewed the Math 60 stuff in week one and taken Math 70 in week two. So I said, you know what? I'll give you guys this option in case there's some of you out there that want to try this. So to do that, I need you to show me that you're capable of uh, doing everything that we, or almost everything that we're going to cover in Math 60 so that you, you do well in Math 70, future math classes, future science classes, and, and you graduate and, and everything goes well. So. Um, so what I'm going to ask you to do is complete the worksheets for Math 60. Okay, so if you click here, all right, and these are free uh, worksheets for our pre-college math classes. The Math 60 worksheets are here. I would like you to complete each of these worksheets without a calculator and submit them to me uh, to show that you can do them, right? And if you do that and just let me know, hey, I'd like to take Math 70, I'm, I'm comfortable with this material, then I will have you switched into Math 70 and you can join Math 70 in week two, okay? So let me show you how these work. Let's go to the first worksheet, decimals, and this page opens up. The worksheet is here. You click that. And if you have a printer, great, you can print that off. You don't need a printer just write the answers out on paper. You don't have to write out the questions, just write out the answers. Well, maybe you wanna write out eight minus 0 0.3 0 0.327 and, 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 and calculate that, right? Complete everything without a calculator. We need to be able to do all of these, th these things without a calculator. It's very important for um, uh, future success and future math and science classes, okay? Um, you'll notice that there's actually an answer key at the bottom, um, but you've got to show your work on paper. Um, if you get stuck on something, let's say you're stuck on question three, there's two options. There's a video that will actually show you the answer to question three. If you click there, here's this video that shows you the answer. Now we'll do question three, and we'll do one example. And then this video will give you an entire lesson on dividing decimals. So lots of examples, an entire lesson on dividing decimals, okay? In this video, we're going to divide decimals. So here's page one, two, page three. Page... Okay, and similarly for other questions. You're stuck on question seven. Um, the answer's here, and here is um, an entire lesson on that, on that topic, okay? So that's the decimal worksheet. That's it, I want you to complete all of that. Then I would like you to complete all of the fractions worksheet, sorry. All of the fractions worksheet. So you click here for the fractions worksheet. Okay, complete all of this. Write everything out on paper. There's an answer key at the bottom. There's um, a little answer video here for each question answered on video. And there's a free lesson on that entire topic. So if you're stuck on adding and subtracting fractions, you can come, you can click on that video and do the entire uh, do an entire lesson there. Okay. So then after that, I'd like you to complete what's next: the order of operations and proportions worksheet. That's this one here. Okay. And lastly, please complete the worksheet on percents. Okay. So here's the worksheet on per cents. So you're writing all this out on paper, right? You can print it off if you want to, but you don't have to. Just write out everything on paper, okay? And um, so we've, we've got all, so imagine we've got all of our four worksheets done in week one, and um, we want to join Math 70 in week two. So how do we do that? How do you submit your work? Well, you've got all of your work on paper, okay? You got all four worksheets done. And now what I want you to do is click on submit assignment up here, okay? And hopefully you'll take pictures of your work. If you've got a scanner, you can scan them. If you've got a phone, you can take pictures 
of your paper with a phone or if you've got a camera you can take pictures of your work with a camera or whatever right and then you just hit browse and you find your pictures I've got a picture right here and um, I'm going to upload that and then I go add another file I want to submit a picture of this file as well so I'm just this is just an example so I'm, I'm submitting some pictures of work I've done I hit submit assignment also in the comments I can say um, I would like to join math 70 in week two please all right um, submit assignments so you've got the work done you say hey I want to take math 70 I know what's in math 60 I completed the material I'm ready to go and that's fine we'll switch over to math 70 in week two and that will save you a class however you also might feel that you know what I need to take math 60 I want to take the class um, I need more time with this material and that's perfectly fine too but at least you've give, I've given you the option and I'm, I'm, I would like to give you the option so so if that's the case um, you can just go back uh, to math 60 and, and let's get started on the math 60 work in math 60 we're starting on 1.1 then we do 1.2 and so on right um, I, I don't mind if if you um, I mean you could skip like 1.1 or 1.2 say if you've spent a lot of time on these worksheets and then you realize you want to switch back to math 60 you can skip the first assignment or two if you want to that's fine I'll make it excused um, but I think you, you're gonna know one pretty soon like right away you'll be thinking you know what I'm gonna take math 60 so you'll go back to 1.1 or you'll be thinking, you know what, I, I can do this stuff and you'll complete all the worksheets and you'll let me know and we'll switch into Math 70 in week two. So it's, so, but that's an option. Uh, I, I'm sorry if it's a little bit confusing, but, but I just wanted the option to be there, all right? Again, you don't have to do this at all. Um, and a reminder, again, make sure to do all of these four worksheets without a calculator, okay? Now, a further option is maybe you've been placed awfully low, maybe, you think you could take mass 97 okay so if you want to take mass 97 that's simple just complete the worksheets for math 70 without a calculator by the way so there's four worksheets for math 70 uh, complete them all just like I talked about math 60 and then I'll place you into math 97 because I teach this class as well or I also teach a college level class called math 107 called math and society and if you want to take that class, then you complete the worksheets for Math 97, all four of these worksheets, okay? So there's your options, and um, let me know if you have any questions, and um, I hope that helps.